I'm a psycho about skincare. It's no joke. <laughs> So, as you can tell, my hair just keeps getting shorter and shorter. There is no limit for me. When I was younger, I used to, my hair was my security blanket, and then I just started experimenting and taking it, you know, an inch shorter, and then I went for the lob, and then I went for a bob, and now I'm like, I don't even know what length this is, but um, I wanted like a French girl inspired look, but I would definitely do a pixie cut. Uh, there's nothing I wouldn't try. I know how to conceal a zit like no other. I used to, a couple years back, like struggled with my skin and so I really just figured out how to contour them. It's all about the powdering it. You have to, yeah, there's, there's a lot of tips and tricks I've learned, but I don't know how to do much else, but that, that I can do. My most meaningful tattoo is probably my newest. It's my light bulb that I got on the back of my arm. And my name, Lucy in Latin means as of light. And I actually have light tattooed on me too, but this is a representation of my name. And it was um, done by Dr. Wu, who is just so cool and so artistic and um, probably my favorite tattoo artist. So I feel lucky that I got an appointment with him. Um, but also I got um, this tattoo with all the PLL cast members and sort of represents our seven years together. The most treasured item in my wardrobe is, um, well, I'm not wearing it today, but um, it's a ring. It was given to me when my grandmother passed away, but it's been in my family for a really long time. It was my grandmother's, and my great-grandmother's, and I believe my great-great-grandmother's. Um, and it's so old that it's actually falling apart, so I have to get it welded back together, but it's beautiful. If I had more time, I would do more face masks and sheet masks. And I already do a lot of them, but it's all about that sheet mask life. Three to four times a week, I would say I do masks. But you should also see my sheet mask drawer because that's what I buy on Amazon. It's just like, and I'm so into Korean skincare, so um, you could say, you could say I, I collect those. <laughs> So the one thing that I'm absolutely dying to tell you is that my favorite holiday is coming up. July 29th is National Lipstick Day. <laughs>